Let's do this, folks. Welcome back to Enderal. I am PC Outcasts. And what was I doing? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm heading over towards uh, Jasper, right? Tell Jasper about Yero's life letters. Tell Jasper about Alfred's stories. So he's across. He's across there for some reason. Ooh, yeah. Nice and clear. Beautiful. Should I kill these things? Ooh, an imposing king crab. I guess I might as... Hello? Uh... Hmm. Muscle meat. What the heck? Search chest. How the hell are they staying in that position? Okay. Don't ask questions. You're not qualified for the answer for. Okay, food. Do I have food? I don't really like these um, these icons. They're just they're not that clear to me. Oh. Oh. Giant mud crab. With one arm missing. Yeah, do I continue just you know, getting some experience? Killing crabs? Ow. I'm not even sure what these crab things do. What the crab shells do. Let's, uh, let's eat one. Restore stamina. Okay. Lots of crabs. What's that over there? Kind of looks like a long, very, very, very long dock. Oh! They're mining something. Mining it and then... And then what? Taking it down... Taking it down to the water to load onto a ship? Is that the idea here? Or terminal discovered. Eh. <laughs> what? Oh. Um. Why? Okay. Let's uh. Let's see here. We need to try to get far enough ahead that I can actually shoot at them. Oh. Such language. Oh, are they running away from them? Okay, here we go. There we go. Where are they? How did I get so far ahead? Ah! 
Okay, she's done. Can I get a bead on his head? Answer is yes. Nice. Leather shield, is that better than what I've got? No. Same thing. Uh, I just climb up here. Thank you. All right, so yeah, they were waiting to ambush me. It was cool. Okay, so they had some had a mine over there. They rolled it down here. Morning air potion. Restore stamina. Yeah, and an apprentice book on mentalism. Any more jerk faces around here? That requires a little bit of finesse. Oh, not that hard. Life potion. Life is increased by lube oil. I don't know. Ah, eh, whatever. Take the the iron ore too. How come it's backwards? Shouldn't be facing this way. Pirate hideout. Oh. Okay. Oh, what is it coming? How come this is down hill? It's coming. Okay. Well, whatever. We'll. Um, I guess we'll worry about that later. Go talk to Jasper. It's weird, um, it's only, my chat's only showing up, showing one of the chats. This is one of two. Hmm. Hey, another ice claw. Axe and a hammer? No. We take that ice claw. Is it here? Or is it in food? Oh, it's in food. Oh, this is Zero's house. I see. That's why. Oh, did, yeah, did he tell me that he was gonna come here? Um... How do I get up there? Hang on just a second. Hmm. Now yeah, it shows the stream coming through on both Twitch and YouTube. For some reason my chat is not not behaving. It says Twitch is coming through, but YouTube is not. Oh well. Okay. Well, apparently if you want to chat with me, you'll have to go to Twitch. Use Twitch to chat.
So how exactly do I get up there to speak to... Speak to him? Do I have to jump across here? Um, yeah, this is going to be trouble, isn't it? Come on, why am I not... Why am I not equipping... The shield? While I'm in here, I might as well read that book. Mentalism has been increased. Now give me the shield. There you go. Yarrow. This is a pet rat. There's another one. Another one. Uh, disciplines of magic, entropy. Probably another ridiculously long book, like every other book in this game. Leather cuirass blueprint and a small backpack. Oh, so there is blood. Do I want to go in here? Novice? Okay. Staff of healing. Sounds good. Uh, footprints of the well-traveled one. Saw, spare parts, take those, use them, or nails, I don't know. Some spoiled cheese, probably not. Peace weed, yeah, to smoke some of that. Rotten garlic, well, that's probably not a good thing. Well, apparently rotten garlic does actually do something. Oh, poison damage. Yes. That's that's bad. Oh, I can I should probably take that. I can make poisons. Spoiled cheese, might as well. Might be useful for something. Skeleton. The Skinner and Wild Magic and Vin a geographical overview. And a jeweler box. Light magic spells cost 7% less. And a flawless garnet. Okay. Seems good. Let's, let's eat something. Spoiled cheese. Five points of poison damage. Can I actually... If I click on that, is it just going to poison me? Yes, it is. Damn. That's a shame. I was hoping I could, like, mix it to make a potion or something. I mean, a poison. Oh well, let's take a look at those books. Wild magic. Question is, how long is this? Now, is it a... St it's like a story, right? Yeah. Geographical overview of Vin. Lands of the civilized world. Endril. Azarel, Gora, okay. Nairam, alright. Sounds good. I guess here, um, Jasper's down here, somewhere. Fine clothes. 
Spelltown, Blazing Spark level 1. Oh. Trap. Highwayman got killed. Leather Curious, you know? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Leather Curious gives me a bit more... Mana doesn't regenerate as fast, but I'm not really using magic, right? So... Leather Shoes. Already got the leather shoes. It's like the Vagabond gloves. Don't really want to wear the helmet. Oh yeah, what is this? Sneak is 4% better and increases your stamina by 4 points. Seems interesting and it's also got more armor. Than what I'm using. Put the uh, old vagrant gloves on. Did I say? I think I said vagabond. <laughs> okay. Most importantly, how do I look? Wow, that looks way too heavy to be light armor. And should I be sneaking? Not sure. No, that sounds like uh, Jasper's bad singing. This place is a freaking death trap, man. Ah, uh, that's heavy armor, I believe. This is... this is all... this is just, like, wrong. This is all wrong all the time. Now a good pipe. Dude. It's down there. And memory book. Oh, I'll take well, it. Well, if it isn't my new friend. Any luck? Yeah, what the hell are you doing sitting in the basement here with all these traps set? Give me the, uh, the memory thing. Where is it? Uh... Memory book! Where are you? So, okay, so it's not one of these. Right? I'm not missing something. Um, I can't remember where those things are. It's kind of like a consumable almost. Not in there. Oh, there, yeah. Apparently, you eat memory books. Okay, dude. So I had a chat with Alfred. He seems to think that, and tell Jasper about Alfred's story. Yeah, I found what Yero tried to get rid of here. Have a look, show the letters. What about you? Did you find anything? I did, yeah. Some kind of closed off room down the hallway here. Just give me some time to figure out how to get it open. Okay. Uh, well, I'll show you the letters. Interesting. I didn't know about his companion's fate, to be honest. Hmm. Irony of fate, isn't it? Murdered by those you wanted to help. But the Order will definitely be interested in these letters. Well done. That just leaves the old man in the village. Yeah, I talked to him already. Well, well. That's interesting. Good work. That should be all we need, then. Splendid. I did, and now I finally know what to make of it. Come, follow me. Okay, so apparently I should have done that first. Fog sponge.
Encyclopedia Arcana, part four. Just hang on, guy, uh, dude. I just have to uh, check things out here. Filled soul gem, leather helmet. A starling lock. <clears throat> okay. Another starling lock. I present a star people's lock. And I bet my buttocks will find another answer behind that door over there. A star people's lock? I never heard of that. Doesn't surprise me. This kind of lock is usually only found in treasuries or castles. But they can be picked, but that's going to be quite the challenge without the bolts. Normally, yeah. It's quite simple, actually. Every keyhole has a matching bolt that latches into place once you insert it. And once all the keyholes, five in our case, are latched, the door the lock protects opens up. If you don't have the matching bolts, however, you should prepare yourself for the most frustrating break-in of your life. That is, if you don't happen to be Jaspar. Who knows a little trick? And what would that be? You can use wooden sticks instead of bolts. They'll break a couple of seconds after you put them inside the lock, but if you manage to get all five sticks into place before the first one breaks, you can basically trick the mechanism. It's all about speed, in other words. So I'd say you do the running and I'll wait near the pressure plate. You ready? That sounds like crap. All right. Splendid. Fine. Here are the sticks. All right. Go. So first we save, then we check this. Take that. Okay, so we got one, two, three. Two, three, and then where are the rest? You did say five, did you not? Open all five. Is there more back here? No, that doesn't seem right. Oh. Oh, I see two more right there. Okay. Okay, let's see. What order should we do this in? Probably this one. Run over, do those two, drop down. Whoops. Uh, oh, crap. Yeah, that one. And then... Damn, that was too slow. Oh. We'll try it again. Gah. Damn, that was too slow. We'll try it again. All right. Damn, that was too slow. We'll try it again. Uh, are you are we broken? Damn, that was too slow. We'll try it again. Okay, it's broken. Okay. Good at this. Now let's take a look and see what the old magister didn't want anyone to see, shall we? So that lock, that door is going to lock behind us, isn't it? Hmm. Yeah, go ahead. Oh shit! Yo! Oh. Going to explode like it does in Skyrim. Yep. Oh, an earth elemental, and not a weak one. This Yarrow knew about magic, that's for sure. Mm -hmm. That leaves us with the question of what exactly this is supposed to be. Hello, Lellers. 
A corpse? It looks like a corpse, but who? Hmm. I suppose that's his companion. Though it's interesting that he was already on the wrong side of the law way before his rampage. Uh, he was on the wrong side of the law? Hmm. Well, burials are considered heathen here in Enderal, and have been forbidden for about 300 years now. Here, corpses are always cremated. The whole thing's called the last journey. The deceased is taken to a place he or she considered special during his or her life immediately after dying. That's the only way the soul can move on to the eternal paths. Sounds very poetic, but I'm pretty sure the only reason the Order introduced the law was to prevent plagues. Plus, they might have noticed that too many lost ones running around on trade routes aren't that much fun for wanderers and traveling merchants. <laughs> so, burying someone like that's considered a crime? Yeah, but of course that only goes for the little man. The rich and powerful still tend to their family crypts. And there are still plenty of old vaults around from the time before this whole last journey thing was begun. And it's good that way. What would life as a treasure hunter be like without the notorious noble looking for family jewels in a century-old grave? Great, well I'm glad you could join me. I'm only here for a little bit too. I got, uh, got an appointment as well. But um, I think I'm going to play for another half hour or so. So what, do you, what are we going to do now, my friend? First of all, we are going to eat something because I'm not in very good shape. Stew, wine, yeah, some pumpkin should be good. What have we got here? Okay, the elemental, take that. 